Uh, this Sunday is going to be uh, Father's Day mm-hmm. and uh, a very, a very awesome time. In fact, the the, the Monday after, I thought maybe uh, Gnurk and I uh, could uh, call uh, our dads. But we, and we should of course, call each celebrate other. Celebrate not a Father's Day. We should call each other's dads. <laughs> <laughs> Aww, <laughs> Wouldn't that be hilarious if we called me. your dad? I know, it's a, it's a sad day. It's also a sad day for Gnurk, though, because we made radio history last year when he called. You want to give a little bit of a background what, to your for, Not a Father's for Day? For Not a Father's Day. Not a Father's Day. It's very. It was actually a very serious. Because on Sunday, you know, everyone, everyone that's had children, men especially, of course, celebrate Father's Day. Mm-hmm. But then there's those men out there who either have no children by choice or by the woman's choice. Mm-hmm. And we like to consider that as not a Father's Day. Yeah. Mm. So last year, Father's Day came around. Venkman very excited. You know, he's a father now. Yeah. This would be the, last year was my probably <coughs> second Father's Day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Me, not a Father's Day. Not a Father's Day. <laughs> Me, not a Father's not Day. Not a Father's Day. Mm-hmm. But you, you need to go into more detail. So then I we actually got on the phone. Well, I set it up beforehand. Uh, my uh, college girlfriend, she actually had gotten pregnant at one point and... Uh, and I could have potentially been a father, but that didn't happen. So we talked with her. Yes. So when they were in college, mm-hmm. Gunner, and this is me painting my picture again. So when when they were, I'm not in, racing up to just finish your story. Here. When when they were finish in college, finish your story, my story. I'll finish your story for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when 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 they were in college, uh, Gunner had a very serious girlfriend, mm-hmm. right? And uh, they were, what, roommates in, a, in in college? In a dorm In room. a dorm, right? Which is probably illegal in South Really? A Dakota. man and woman? Yeah, that's what I thought would be weird. Uh, but, uh, you know, weird things happen. And so it anyway. It was college. We were close. Very close. Oh. In fact, they in got fact, so close. We got too close. <laughs> that she ended up pregnant, right? Mm. Snap. In, in so, college. In college. Snap. With their entire life ahead of them. Mm. And so Gnurk, being the, the a-hole that he was back in the day, convinced her to get an abortion very controversial in the 1960s wow <laughs> it wasn't the 1960s oh. all right it was the 1930s it wasn't the 1960s <laughs> <laughs> sorry oh. but anyway it was so. a depression we didn't need more children <laughs> no but uh but but so and so he and this is a something that you regret to this day for the most part correct i do now he, he, he regrets it now and not another time so anyway well, so at the he time called, it seemed like the best most uh imp- the best thing to do was to finish college. There for, was still for her and for you. For both of us, yeah. And so she did finish college. I didn't. Okay. So, so then he calls her up last Friday or last uh, last, last year, year on on uh, Father's Day. No, on, on, our, on, our, on, on our Father's Monday. Day Monday, I guess the day after. Not a Father's Day. Not a Father's Day. Mm-hmm. And so he calls her up and and you know has this like brief conversation with her and basically just apologizes well, to her. Well, she kind of tells the story too and yeah, you know. Yeah, she, she goes And she we, knew you guys She paints the picture air, right? and oh, Venkman yeah. didn't rush right in and oh, cut her okay. off. I didn't. So so <laughs> 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 So so it was it's something that you you would want to probably I think we we put it up on so YouTube. So now what would I do? So? I'd have to call Florice now. <laughs> <laughs> We'd keep this story alive <laughs> with the it, not a father's just day. Just keep it going. How many women have potentially b- got <laughs> Not not wanted gonna not baby. one not one of my baby. Yeah. Uh, so uh, I mean, but can you blame him? Okay, yeah. so continue on. I'm curious. So no, so he he gets her on the phone mm-hmm. and he basically you know and she she knew that we were gonna call. We we kept her name. Uh, um, yeah, we used a, a an on air name. Secret. Yeah, so and, that and people would know. But we referred to her as Miss Nibs. Miss an alias. Miss Nibs, and uh-huh. uh, and he basically which you know, was actually my dad's nickname for her. Just uh, apologized to her on the air and. Uh, and she basically said it's okay that, you know, she's... she's well, Venkman set it up, you know, by going, hey, did you know that your ex-boyfriend is a big... A big radio star. And she goes, no, not really. And I said, <laughs> well, 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 good, because he's not. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, but, uh, no, so so we you know, we did a little uh, conversation with her, and, uh, he, you know, he said he was sorry, but she, she's got, she's got like a 15-year-old kid. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No, like a college, uh, high school senior, and the other boy, I believe, is like a... Uh, junior mm-hmm. in college and now. And they, they don't know that, that she did this. And so then we're like, well, when like when are you going to tell them? And she's and like... She's got, and the older son's got a kind of a girlfriend that's a little bit serious, and she's concerned that... It's going to happen all over again. Yeah, that she could uh, they could have the same mm-hmm. circumstances that she and I did. Mm-hmm. So she's making her son get a vasectomy. 
No, she didn't. Okay, that's that. not so. You're part not of the story finishing the story. No, that, that's that's the that's the end of the story. Like he calls oh. up, apologizes, very serious radio, and then bam, out to break. And it was it was something very odd for us, but uh, but you know, it was it was one of those things where you're like, oh, that's a uh, that's some that's some powerful movie. So that uh, could have been stuff. your child, huh? It definitely could have been. Oh, absolutely. Sorry. So, it could, but can you imagine Gnurk with a 15 year old now, or what? That child would have been more than that. Would have been like a 50 year old. <laughs> would not have been a 50 year old. Maybe a 20. This kid would have been older than me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the, ch- the child would have been older than Vangman. Oh, seriously? It's, this was over 30 years ago. I just no. have my dirty 30. Yeah, it would have been older than me. I'm just playing up on my old age. (laughs) Oh, Lord. It probably would have been 25. Mm -hmm. 